Hello ladies and gentlemen, Kenny Duke here, back with the NHL 17 Hockey Ultimate Team Pack Opening. Today guys, we are doing the All-Star Packs Pack Opening. Uh, I have a couple of these Ultra Packs that just came out and a bunch of All-Star Packs and only one Elite Talent Pack as I am broke as fuck at the end of the month right now, unfortunately. I didn't quite save up good enough. Um, <laughs> so I think we're going to start with the big packs and then go through these All-Star Packs. Because I have some stuff for sale, and maybe to sell, and maybe we'll be able to do more. But right now, we only have 10 packs to open. We're going with a big one. It's All-Star Weekend right now. This is a Sunday afternoon. The cards are out from the skills competition, as well as there's some collectibles in these packs. Up to six, I think is what it says. So far... Ooh, okay, there's a collectible. Okay, come on. A Bacchus. All right. Would love one of those All-Star cards. Maybe that 97 Crosby. I, I could settle with that. Second collectible. Oh, these are big packs though. McKinnon. Come on. Give me something in the end. Fuck. Alright. Okay. It's alright. It's okay. I got I got two collectibles. That's, yeah. And a Bacchus. Yeah. But that's okay. Things are alright. We'll do some Ultra Packs. See how good they are. Maybe we can get one of those special cards in it. I don't know if we can get collectibles in them. But I know I can get collectibles Right? No, no. That I said that wrong. I said that's so awful. I think you have special cards in these, but I don't know if you can get collectibles in there. That makes more sense. Now, I don't know what it is this year, but I could not be any less interested in the all-star festivities of themselves. I'm just I'm just not into it. Um, I mean I watched some of the skills competition last night. It was it was okay, it was cool. I don't know how I felt like with no props and stuff in the shootout. I, I know it's kind of childish that stuff. I always thought it was pretty funny though. It was always pretty creative at times. I kind of enjoyed it for that. The whole creativity aspect of it. And the game today, I don't know if I'm going to watch it. I didn't go to a night's game tonight. I don't even know what time the All-Star game's on. If it's on in the afternoon, maybe I'll watch some of it. If it's on tonight, probably not going to watch any of it because I'm going to be away. And I'm not going to be upset I missed it at all. And no, it's not because John Scott's not in it. I couldn't have cared less about that last year. So I don't know why I don't care this year. It's just, eh, it's just meh. Maybe I'm sad because Frankie Corrado isn't the Leafs attendee over in Austin Matthews. I mean, Matthews is good, but like, <laughs> he's no thank Frankie Corrado. Let's be honest, you guys. Come on, let, like, let's be serious. Maybe it's just a boring event. I don't know. Like, I feel like it'd be a really cool event to attend, like to go to. But watching it on TV, I'm just not feeling the appeal. These packs are also god-awful. So maybe that's also why. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I take everything I just said back. These packs are amazing. A fucking Steven Stamkos. Who, baby? I don't know the market at all. But I know a 90 overall card is going to go for a pretty penny. That's, that's what I know. Oh my lord, it does go for a pretty penny. Not as much as I thought it may go for, but a pretty penny regardless. I'll tell you that much. Two more packs. I pray something sells so I can open more, because I want something more than that. As I say that, the stamp codes I just posted sold. So that's good. Landeskog. A collectible. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Things are looking a bit brighter. Another collectible. I still don't think I'm going to be able to afford to do any collections today. Unfortunately. Okay, last pack for now. But we're going to open it and we're going to be happy because we're going to get one of those all-star cards that are out. And an all-star card that's out. We're going to get an all-star Kruger. <sighs> I like to think that if I say it enough, it's going to happen. So I try and open more packs, get enough collectibles for to trade in for Danny Heatley? Or do I just buy a card and collect? Or do I... Yeah, then I have to buy a carbon collectible too. You know what? Let's do this. We're going to buy a collectible. And we're going to open up more. This winter carbon collectible so much. I thought they were like 50 something. Why are they... No. No, 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 no. When the fuck did they become so much? What, what happened? They used to be so nice and cheap. Weren't they around like 50k or something at one time? Now 100k? That's... That's ludicrous. No. No, no, no. That's not how we're doing this. I have something up for like 500k. If it sells, 
we're good. We are good. We're in the clear. Okay? And we can afford those carbon collectibles and get that 90 Heatley. After we pull more collectibles in these packs. Come on! Just work with me here. Okay? No, not okay. Give me that collect. Oh, 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 man. I tell you what. I'm telling you what right now. I don't even want a 97 Crosby. All I want... All I want right now... Just give me some of those collectibles. Just give me some of them beautiful, beautiful black and gold all-star game collectibles, right? Right? No, not that. That's not what I want. Not at all. So we're going to open this one. We're going to skip it. There's going to be a nice little collectible nowhere in these packs. Why? I'm opening these until I can't afford to open them anymore. Just, just, just know that, okay? Just know that. I'm not quitting. I'm no, I'm no quitter. Do I look like a quitter, you guys? No. We got Stamp Coast, and I didn't even quit then. <sighs> I'm, st I'm starting to wish I did quit. <laughs> this is the last one. Last one. That's all I can damn well afford. <sighs> We're gonna throw this nice and slow. And say, oh, thank you for that Bonino. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Please, right here. Come on. Okay, no, I'm just just serious though, right here. I know. Now you're just insulting me. You're just insulting me now, right now. That's I love you, Marner. You're not what I quite wanted though. Unfortunately, all I can do is the 8088 QA and the 87 Tangay. That's all I can afford. But it's better than nothing. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna be happy with that, and all will be right. There's that Tangay, as much as I wanted that beautiful, beautiful 90 Heatley. We're gonna have to settle. We're gonna have to settle. Or that 90. You know what? I would give everything up for that 94 Cabriolet. I just know that's not happening. I know I can't afford that. Being realistic, unfortunately. Now, give me that UA. Doesn't look like a bad card either. Doesn't look like an awful card. Not too bad synergies. Might be good backup on the team. And a collectible. So that's good. Only need three more of those. And I can get started on the 94 Cabriolet. Which, it's not happening. It's not happening. I want it to happen. But it's not. Now Tangate, not a bad looking card either. Okay. So. Oh, beautiful cards. Like the card design in total this. Mwah. That is... Beautiful. Kudos to y'all over at EA for that. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smash the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.